In today's video, we're going to be talking about sun protective clothing, the clothing you wear that will protect your skin, sometimes better than even sunscreen, from melasma, freckling, sunspots, and overall sun damage. Hey guys, my name is Lori Hill, and on this channel, we talk about beauty, plastic surgery, skincare, makeup, and all sorts of things related to lifestyle. So if that sounds good to you, then subscribe. So I've been wearing sun protective clothing for the last five years, and it's really served my skin well. Ever since I started doing it, I've noticed much lighter freckling on my body, much less sun damage, and my melasma has lightened. Now here are some reasons to wear this type of clothing. First of all, a lot of people react very badly to sunscreen on their face. Sunscreen can be something that breaks your skin out or even clogs your pores as well as sunscreen being very expensive to reapply all over your body, especially the ones that work really well. Sunscreen can be unreliable. You never really know how much coverage you're getting. I recently saw a chart that tested out some of the top protective sunscreens and it tested what the sunscreen said the protection was versus what the actual sun protection was. And in many cases, there was a huge discrepancy you never truly know the amount of coverage you're getting. Things like sweating, getting your face and body wet can really affect the coverage of your typical sunscreen. Now you may be wondering, doesn't clothing offer some sun protection? And actually it does, but it very much varies depending on the weave of the fabric, how wet it can get, and the fabric itself. Generally, clothing protects your skin between five to 10%. And UPF clothing is clothing that is rated for a sun protection of 50 and above generally. UPF clothing certifies that their clothing has a certain sun protection level generally what's displayed after the UPF. So a UPF of 30 and above means that you're getting at least 30 SPF protection. The coverings that I'm talking about in this video are mostly ones that I've been wearing for years and have found to be very reliable. Let's get started. Let's start out with my favorite hoodie. I have these two different hoodie styles. Now one is by Athleta and one you can find on Amazon, which I'll link down below. I'll actually link both of them down below. Now I wanted to show you that it also comes in white, which I think is really great for every day. And then this one I wear when I want to kind of be a little bit dressed up and bring more color to my face. Now I believe the ones on Amazon come in a full range of colors, including this one, but you can get them in blue, green, beige, whatever. And this does have a UPF protection of 50 and above. Next up, I have this swimsuit cover-up, which will help protect your vulnerable skin when you're getting out of the water, when the sunscreen may have been washed off from swimming. This is the perfect solution so that you're not exposing your skin to the harmful sun rays. Now, I love this one especially because it has a hood that you can put on, and it actually does give you a lot of protection from your shoulders to about mid-thigh. Next up, I have what I'm calling the Darth Vader shield. Are you brave enough to wear this in the car? Yes, have you seen people walking around with this? This offers so much protection to your facial skin. Did you know that the most preventable type of skin cancer is from overexposure from the sun? Yes, and often a very common place to get skin cancer is on the tip of your nose. This will shield you from the majority of UVA and UVB rays. I believe the protection of this is UPF 50 and above. And you can wear it while you're driving, so you don't necessarily have to wear it around people. You know when you're driving, you see people for a minute and then they're gone, so who really cares what they think? Speaking of driving, I have this soft face shield. This is so breathable and it's much more wearable than you think. Now this is great for when you're driving. If you're going through a drive through and you don't want the person to see you wearing it, you could just slip it right off and it goes back on so easy. It's also great if you're a bicycler or you do anything in the sun for even the briefest amount of time. Next up, I have these driving gloves. Have you ever looked at the skin on your hands in the sunlight? You can definitely see every little wrinkle and splotch. These will protect your hands from getting any more sun damage. Who really wants to remember to put sunscreen on their hands, right? Now this will help you just by slipping them on and using them when you're driving 
that's when I generally use them. Now, as far as answering the phone with them, it's no problem because you can slip it off your finger, just the tip comes off, and you can use your smartphone. Next up, I have the half face shield. Now this is a loose covering that you can wear. You just slip it on over your ears and it covers from the neck down and it really covers this area where a lot of people get sun damage. I think it happens during driving. You can also wear it when you're sunbathing if you don't want sun exposure here. Now, I don't sunbathe anymore, but I do notice that from past sunbathing and past sun exposure that this area of the chest tends to get a lot of sun damage. This will definitely help that area out. Next up, I have this shrug. Do you guys remember shrugs? I feel like people are still wearing them. Now this is for when you just wanna cover your arms. Sometimes your arms are really overexposed to the sun and no other part of your body really is, or maybe you put sunscreen on and you really don't wanna to have to go through putting sunscreen all over your arms, especially if it's expensive. You do wanna preserve it. Put this shrug on, it's so inexpensive, and it'll give your arms protection without having to reapply that sunscreen every hour to two hours. Ever since covering my arms, I've had so much less sun damage to them. Next up, I have this UPF umbrella. Now this is great for when you're actually just walking around and you don't wanna use a UPF face covering. This is extremely sturdy and well-made. This is great in so many different circumstances, whether you're on the beach, walking around in like New York City where the sun's just blazing down on you, it's great for a variety of different atmospheres. Now, how many of you wear baseball hats? I am a baseball hat person. So just so you know, most baseball hats offer about 5% UPF protection from the sun. So I thought the perfect solution was ordering this UPF baseball hat. Now this is my first time ordering it and I think I went a little too large so you may want to size down but I will say it offers a lot of protection especially because the brim of it is a lot larger than your average baseball hat and this whole hat offers UPF 50 and above protection. I didn't include glasses in this video because they're such a personal preference but the glasses you wear need to be a rating of 400 UV and above in order to give you almost 100% protection from UV rays. I will link some down below. Now I have this UPF 50 and above hat. I wear the tan version of this but I also like the black version and this hat is amazing to just keep in your car. When you leave your car put it on. It will offer you so much protection including facial protection as well as your scalp. Scalps often get sunburned. They are also common places to get melanoma and other types of skin cancers. Don't risk it. Just put on this stylish hat. I mean, I think it's stylish. What do you guys think? Now, here's another option for a hat if you want to go a little bit more floppy and carefree. This is the perfect hat. I think it looks great on almost anyone. I love that it has a wide brim and it offers a lot of shielding from the sun and it's cute. Now for a pop of color. You may want to try this. It comes in a variety of different colors and I love the bucket style. It's so adorable and it offers you so much protection. I think this is the ultimate beach hat. It's just so cute. Now last but not least, I have a truly unique product. I've been told about this product and heard so much about it. It's not that easy to get. I've linked it down below. This is not sponsored but I love the idea of it. It's a detergent that when you use it once on your clothes, it gives the clothes a UPF protection of 30 and above just by washing the clothes once. Crazy, right? And I believe that the clothes have a UPF protection for multiple wears after that. It's very economical and it's great for people who don't wanna buy a bunch of UPF clothing. They can just wash their long sleeved garments and pants in this and get sun protection for multiple wears afterwards. So that's a wrap for this video, but let me know what you think of all the different UPF clothing that I showed today. Are there any that you liked? Are there any that you didn't so much like and it wouldn't be worth it no matter how much sun protection you got from them? Let me know down below in the comments. Also, let me know what sunscreen you use and if there are any that you think I should review. I'm gonna be doing a video about all the different sunscreens that I think are worth buying and then some that I don't think are worth it.
Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Bye! Bye! <laughs>